Hey YouTube, it's Slip On Queen here. Just went in here today and I wanted to share a small Shop Miss A haul. So I recently got my order in the mail over the weekend and I wanted to go in here today and share it with you guys and do an un unpackaging, I guess. So let's go ahead and get started. So I got my package in the mail and so it came in a pink uh, mailer. So I'm going to go ahead and use some scissors and get this open so we can try it out. Let's see what I ordered. I didn't order a lot. I ordered just a few items that I needed and then I saw some uh, a few new items that I was interested in trying out. So, let's see if there's anything else in the bag. Okay. So it does come packaged a lot. <laughs> um, which if you've ever ordered from Shop Miss A, you'll definitely know they definitely um, package everything super, super... Um, tight and they also package it multiple times with different material so let me cut this real quick sorry it's so noisy okay now we've got the bowl wrap off let's get the tissue paper and this foam wrap that they put on it All right. Finally, we're in there. Okay. So the first product I want to mention that I ordered is the um, AOA Studio. And this is one of their, um, I think this goes to the Paw Paw Charity. So it's more than a dollar. It's like 55 cent of it goes to the Paw Paw Charity. So it's a dollar fifty-five instead of just being a dollar, and this is their microfiber wonder blender. I have wanted this for such a long time, but every time I go to order it, it's out of stock. And so the other day I went on there and I saw it, and I saw that it was still in stock. So I just went ahead and ordered me one. So I'm so excited to have this. It says part of the proceeds will go towards protecting animals against abuse. So that's amazing. Um, so let me go ahead and open this package, and I will show you guys the. Um, the blender oh my goodness it feels so good I love the color of it too not that that has anything to do with it but I love the color and it feels so nice I'm so excited to have that so super excited for that I'm so glad I finally got a hold of it while they had it in stock all right Okay, so now um, this is backup uh, product for me because I use this BB cream every single day and um, I love the way it feels on my skin. I love the fact it doesn't clog my pores. It's just one of my holy grails from Shop Masse and I absolutely love it. This is their AOA Studio Perfect BB Cream and I get my um, shade in the shade Light. I love these so much guys. Every time I place an order, I try to buy two of these because there was a time I went to go order some and they were out of stock and I was like, oh my gosh, that's my color and I don't want to ever run out of it. So I always try to order two of them. So very, very excited to have my backups. And then this one I repurchased because I ran out of this shade. This was the medium brown um, AOA Studio Sculpting Brow Pencil. This one is my favorite. Right now I'm using, I think, the, is it the caramel color. I use that one right now. But um, I actually like mine to be a little bit darker. So um, I was so happy that they had the medium brown back in stock because I had bought the caramel one on a whim because they didn't have the medium brown last time I went to order it. So I do have my backup of my medium brown again when I run out of the caramel one. So very happy to have that. And then the last two items, I told you it was a small haul. Um, these are new to the site. These are the AOA Studio lip balms. And I'm so excited. They're 100% natural. And uh, they're cruelty free. And they are... Um, this one's a mint lip balm. They had a bunch of different flavors. But I just picked up the mint. And then I picked up the honey. So we're going to try them out. I mean, why not? Um, I'm going to wipe my lips off. Make sure I have nothing on them. And then we're going to do some first impressions of them. So let me get my wipe here. Let me wipe off my lips. And I will let you guys know what I think of these. Alright. So we're going to do the mint one first. So 
So it's a clear balm. Oh, it has a really nice mint scent. Oh, that smells good. Okay, so let's try it out. Okay, this one's really nice. Um, I'm actually super impressed by this. Um, these are really smooth when they go on. They glide. Um, and... This one has a nice mint scent, and it's like a real fresh mint scent. And um, once you apply it to the lips, it gives you a slight like mint tingle to your lips. I really love that about mint lip balms. So this one's really nice, and um, I do recommend it if you're looking for a natural lip balm, and you maybe want to order from something from the site. This is a really good choice. I actually really like this one. It just feels so smooth. It don't feel waxy. It don't feel thick. It just feels like a medium consistency on the lips, and it's really nice. So, super excited for this, and this one is the Mint AOA Studio Lip Balm. So, I really love that. So, now on to the Honey Lip Balm. So, let's wipe my lips off. Alright, I'm going to twist it. So, it's a clear balm as well. So let me swatch it because I don't get much scent when I first smell it. Okay, so this one is very light. Like, it's not a strong honey scent at all. In fact, if I was blindfolded to smelling this, I wouldn't even know it was honey. Because it's so light that you have to use your imagination knowing that's honey. Um, wow, just by scent. So let's try it out and I'll see if it changes. But right now, just by the scent... I would not know that it was honey if I was blindfolded. Because it's so light. It's so light, guys. Like, you get a little hint of a honey scent, but it's super light. So, let's try it out. Yeah, like I said, it feels amazing on the lips, just like the mint lip balm. But, um... It's super, super light to where, like I said, I wouldn't know it was honey if I was blindfolded and I just applied a lip balm. Um, but it does have a very, very, very light, subtle hint of a honey scent, but it's very, very light. And um, so I do think they're a win if you're looking for just a natural lip balm that just has very light flavor to it or scent. Um, but um, I think out of the two that I tried, that mint's my favorite because I can actually smell the mint and it has that cooling effect on my lips. The honey one doesn't have the cooling effect, but I wouldn't expect it to because I know mint lip balms most of the time, if they're natural, they'll have the peppermint oil in it that makes that amazing, refreshing tingle on your lips and stuff. So um, this one is probably my favorite because it has that mint tingle and it has an amazing mint scent. But the honey one feels good on the lips as well. It just doesn't have a strong scent at all. So... I wanted to get here today, um, do this quick haul with you guys and some first impressions on those lip balms. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please hit the like, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. And I hope you guys have a blessed day. Thanks. Bye.